a white shirt? Tell me the color shoes she got on. Look down and tell me the color of her shoes. Blue. They're blue? Wow. Okay. Very, very good, Jim. Very, very good. Okay. We're going to come forward just a little bit. I'm going to take you to your 16th birthday. You're 16 years old. You're glad to be 16 because of a defining moment in your life. Did you have a party that day? What you doing on your 16th birthday? You did what? You went to the Maikai. Wow. And who were you with? Your family? And who all's there? Tell me the name. Look around and tell me who all you see. It's Erica. Erica? Jen. Jim. Kayla. Kayla. Katie. Okay. What's Katie wearing? They call it. Some white shirts and jeans. White shirts and jeans. Okay, and what are you wearing? All white dress. All white dress. And uh, what's your mom's there? Huh? The stepmother. What is she wearing? A floral dress. A floral dress. Okay, very, very good. All right, all right. And sleep all the way down. All the way down. Breathe in, blowing out. In the question, motherfucker. <laughs> <coughs> she can't hear nothing me. She can't hear nothing you say. This shit's crazy. On the count of three, when you're awake, a guy's gonna be standing up right behind me. Come here. You're not gonna know who he is. You've never seen this guy before in your entire life. The harder he tries to make you remember who he is, it's gonna become a blur. You're not gonna know who he is, you're not gonna know anything about him. And he's going to try to make you remember him. You say, I don't know who you are. And the harder he tries to make you remember, the more you're going to forget. He does not exist. You've never seen him a day in your life. A lot of suggestions sink in. It's absolute truth and total reality. And one, two, three. By the way. By the way. Look at me. You look so, so good. <laughs> That's all right. You're doing great. For some reason, this, somebody keeps telling me they know you. I'm so sleepy. That's okay. You're doing good. Have you ever seen this guy before you went? Couple times. You know who he is? No. You, you don't know his name? I, I know him as well. You know? But I mean, have you ever seen him around anywhere or anything? Do you never remember him going anywhere? I do. A little bit? Okay. And look at me. And sleep. All the <laughs> way down. All the way down. Relax and perfectly. Mm. Relax and perfectly. All the way down. Relax and perfectly. Let him go. Let him go. Let him go deeper, more relaxed, all the way down. And sleep, 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 all the way down. Ten times more deeper, relaxed, all the way down. Take a deep breath in, pull it out, all the way down. Now you want me to forget this all together? I can make a, I can raise you all that mind all together. Right now, I just took a slight white. Now, I'm going to make her forget you that you ever existed, that she never saw you before in her life. No matter how she look at you, she will not be able to see who you are or know who you are. This is how I make girls forget that they have been raped or whatever the case might be by somebody and that they are having problems. I can turn it down a little bit or I can completely erase the memory completely out of their mind. Right there, I just turned it down just a little. See, I, I know. I, right. But I can. I don't know who that motherfucker is. I never seen him. No. That's how easy. You gonna bring it back, though. Yeah, we <laughs> Okay. And all the way down. Sleeping deeper, more relaxed. Sleeping deeper, take a deep breath. Now then. <laughs> Relaxing. All the way down. This time we're gonna go just a little bit deeper. What I want you to do right now is I want you to concentrate on everything I tell you to concentrate on and focus on everything I tell you to focus on. A lot of suggestions say yes, after the truth and total reality. I want you to imagine that you're on the top of a, of a building. It's 10 floors. And as you get in the elevator, and you push the doors to the elevator to open, imagine yourself pushing those doors to the elevator to open. And as you open that door, it goes thing, the door is open. And with each floor, that elevator drops down and gives you the name 
thing, you're going to drop ten times more deeper, relaxed. A lot of suggestions sink in, it's absolute truth and total reality. As you push the, the door down, you push the floor number one. Imagine the door closing. As that door closes, you push the elevator button that says one. And now the elevator starts its ascension down. With each floor that goes down and you take a deep breath, you're going to drop a little bit more deeper, relax. All the way to number one. When it hits number one, you're going to relax every nerve, muscle, fiber, tissue in your mind and body and go into a complete deep state of relaxation. A lot of suggestions say, yes, absolute truth and total reality. Here we go. Elevator starting down. Ten down to nine. Thing. More relax. Nine down to eight. Ding. Take a deep breath in. Rolling out. Sinking deeper. More relax. Eight down to seven. Ding. Deeper. More relax. All the way down. Seven down to six. Releasing all nerves. Tension, stress, anxiety in your mind and body going into a complete and total state of relaxation. Six down to five. Ding. Feel yourself sinking, drifting, dreaming, floating, going deeper, more relaxed. Five down to four. Ding. Deeper, more relaxed. All the way down. Four down to three. Ding. And on the count of one, I want you to just come out like a sack of potatoes. Every nerve, muscle, and fiber in your body is going to go completely relaxed, and you're going to just melt like butter. Three down to two. Ding! And here we go. Two down to one. Ding! in your body completely and totally relaxed. A lot of suggestions sink in is absolute truth and total reality. From this point forward, you're going to follow my each and every instruction immediately without hesitation. It's going to become your absolute truth and total reality. A lot of suggestions sink in is absolute truth and total reality. When I tell you something, it will be immediately without hesitation to become your absolute truth. Now then, Ginger, I want you to give me this arm. Make it stiff as a board. Make it stiff as a board. Stiff as a board. Stiff. Ball your fist up. Stiff as a board. Don't bend it. Let it stay right there. Keep it right there. Stiff as a board. It cannot bend. So keep it right there. Keep it right there. Stiff as a board. Stiff as a board. Give me this hand right here. Stick it out. Ball your fist up. Stiff as a board. Meaning that no matter how hard I try, it cannot bend. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Stiff as a board. Everything I touch from this point forward will become stiff as a board, meaning that it will not be able to bend. Stiff as a board. You don't want to put eyes open. Eyes open. Stiff as a board. No matter how hard I try, I cannot bend this arm. It is stiff as a board. This is stiff as a board. I cannot bend you. It is stiff as a board. These are stiff as a board. Your feet are locked in position, meaning that they cannot move. Stiff as a board. Stiff as a board. Just like a mannequin. Stiffer, 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 stiffer. That's okay. Stiffer. You remain asleep. Sleep. Standing up. That's okay. Relax. Relax your mind. Stiff as a board. No matter how hard, I try, you cannot bend this arm. It is like an iron rod, stiff as a board. <laughs> stiff as a board. Now, feet locked in their position, feet locked, and when you feel me, close my hand. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. The instant, we're going to make a mental connection, a mental connection. The minute you feel me clench my fist, you're going to fall back. Feet locked in that position, you're just going to take one step, not one step, the feet are going to be glued to the floor, and you're going to fall back into my arms. The minute you feel me, not before, the minute you feel me,
Let it go. Back to me. That's okay. I got you. I got you. All the way back up. All the way back up. All the way back up. Look at me. Look at me. Arms back up. I was stiff as a board. Arms back as a board. That's okay. That's okay. You cannot bend this. You cannot bend it. Not, you cannot bend it. Stiff as a board. so still, you're going to be just like a mannequin. Just like a mannequin. Meaning that nobody can bend you. Stiff as a board. Everything stiff as a board. Stiff as a board. Stiff. Stiff. Stiffer. Stiffer. I want to feel it stiff. It's locked. It cannot bend no matter what. And you want to fall back to me? And now. Grab a feet. Grab a feet. Stiff as a board. Put a feet on that chair. Stiff as a board. Stiff. Stiff. Get the other chair. Stiff. Stiff as a board. Stiff. Stiff. Meaning that no matter how hard anybody try, I can stand on you and not be able to break your body. And I can go home and come back and she'll stay just like that comfortable if I wanted to. Okay? Very good. And so stiff as a that's okay. You're supposed to be. Just like that. <laughs> My Just like that. Hurt. I got you. I'm still stiff. <laughs> I know, stiff. Stiff. She can't be. She's stiff. I can go home back. and come back. And relax. <laughs> All the way down. Have a seat. Have a seat. Have a seat. Just sit. Have a seat. Look at me. Relaxing perfectly. Concentrate with you, I'm so. Uh, I love you. <laughs> Look at me. I did fall asleep. Look at me. Sleep. All the way down. All the way down. Relaxing perfectly, concentrating perfectly. Feeling absolutely wonderful. Take a deep breath in. Blowing out. Another deep breath in. Blowing out. Going deeper and deeper. More relaxed, all the way down. Relaxing perfectly, concentrating perfectly, and sleep all the way down. Feeling good. Totally, totally good. Now then, you know, I guess I'm not going to let her read. I'm sure that's crazy stuff. I need something small right here. On the count of three. On the count of three. When you awake, we're going to correct your vision. That means that you're going to be able to see better than you've ever seen in your entire life. That means that when you're awake, the colors in this room are going to be very vibrant. They're going to be very, very contrasting. You're going to be able to focus in on things. You're going to have perfect vision, 20-20 vision. No better yet, 20-25 vision because you're young. We're going to improve your vision so much that you're going to be able to read things that you have not been able to see in a long time. A lot of suggestions sink in. This is the absolute truth and total reality. What I want you to do right now is I want you to concentrate on all the nerves and parts of your eyes. I want you to concentrate on the retina, the optic nerve. Concentrate on the lenses, the iris. Feel it getting stronger as if you were 16 years old. You'll have better vision than you ever had in your entire life. I want you with your eyes closed. I want you to look up, look down, look to the left, look to the right. Now rotate your eyes all around. Feel them working. Feel them tingling. Feel them getting stronger. Feel them getting vibrant. You're going to be able to see blues, yellows, oranges, whites, any color going to be so contrasting, it's going to be so, so exciting to be able to see better than you've ever seen in your life. You're not going to need glasses, you're not going to need any type of contacts or any type of visual aid. You're going to be looking like you're looking through a micro microscope. It's going to look like everything in this damn room is in 3D. It's going to be so exciting to you. A lot of suggestions again, it's absolute truth and total reality. On the count of three, when you're awake, you're going to be able to see better that you've ever seen in your life. With your eyes closed, look up, look down, look to the left, look to the right. Now rotate them all around. Feel them getting stronger, feel them getting stronger and stronger and stronger. And on the count of three, when you're awake, 
You're going to look at me, and with each blink of your eye, it's going to become clearer and clearer and clearer. So clear that it's going to be like amazing. You're going to be able to see things that you haven't seen before, haven't noticed before. Allow this just to sink in. You're going to have perfect vision. One, two, three. Why wait? Look at me. Blink out. Blink again. Now blink and hold them tight. And when you open them, everything will look like it's in 3D. And open them. You see things? Can you read that? Yeah. Can you see that from here? Yeah. And here? Yeah. And here? Mm -hmm. You read that? Oh, I can't read it. All right, read it now. Is that funny? <laughs> Everything's like the 3D, huh? <laughs> now look at me and sleep. All the way down. Relaxing perfectly. Concentrating perfectly. Going deeper. More of the relax. Take a deep breath in. Going out. And another deep breath in. Going out. And on the count of three, when you awake, I'm going to show you how to put yourself to sleep at night. Because if you're having problems sleeping at night, I'm going to show you a very, very profound way to put yourself to sleep immediately without hesitation. And you're going to follow this anytime you want to go to sleep at night, whether you want to sleep for a minute, an hour, six hours, however the time allow you to go to sleep, you're going to wake up feeling better than you ever felt in your entire life. You're going to sleep deep, deep down sleep. It's going to take about three seconds to show you how to put yourself to sleep from this point forward. I'm going to kind of think you want to wait, waiting on my instructions to show you how to go to sleep. And one, two, three, why wait? Jenny, you're doing so good. You are the best I ever had. Okay, do my favor. You right hand. I am right hand. Okay, right open your hands like this, spin them apart. Put it right here in front of you. Notice the palms in your hand. Notice how they're going in and out of focus. Lock it right here. Notice how they're going in and out of focus. And this time, as your hand, lock it right here. As your hand fall forwards. After three times, the minute you make any contact with any part of your face, you're going to collapse all your muscles, close your eyes, and fall into a deep, deep hypnotic sleep. Look at it. Here we go. One, two, and three. All the way down. Deep, deep asleep. Dreaming, drifting, floating. All the way down. Anytime you want to go to sleep, that's how long it takes you to go to sleep. You will not have any insomnia. You're going to sleep deeply and sound. <laughs> Without waking up, the only thing that will be able to wake you up would be an alarm clock or your telephone or an emergency siren from this point forward. That would be your trigger to go to sleep, whether it be on the plane, whether it be in the car, whether it be in your room. If you want to get to sleep in three seconds, that's how long it takes you to fall into a deep, deep, profound sleep. A lot of suggestions sink in and become an immediate part of your subconscious for the rest of your life. A lot of suggestions sink in. You absolutely want it. On the count of three, you're wide awake, and you're going to show me how to do it once again. So therefore, we can set this trick in your mind and lock it in. One, two, three. Wide awake. Very good, Jenny. Do me a favor. Show me how to do it one more time. I want you to go to sleep. And then you want to. Show me what you do. Sweat your fingers apart. No, sweat your fingers apart. Put your hand up. And show me how to do it three times. One. Two. And... absolutely wonderful in each and every way. Now then, has she ever spoken to you about any pain? She has any pain? She has any pain? <laughs> no. No pain? Like in the neck, arms, leg, uh -huh. headaches, anything like that? No menstrual pain, anything? Okay, that's fine. I don't have to worry about pain management. Okay. Now then, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you back to your childhood. 
ginger, because every woman has menstrual cream. <laughs> but I want you to do right now. I want you to focus and concentrate on any part of your body that is experiencing pain, whether your neck, your shoulders, your back, your ankle, or whether it's menstrual pain or whatever the cramps might be. Anytime that you have pain in your body, I want you to be able to manage that pain just as if you had just taken a pain pill, the most powerful pain pill there is on this earth. This pain pill will block any neurotransmitter from transmitting any pain to your body. So what I want you to do is I'm going to give you a trigger. This trigger is going to be simple. I want you to concentrate on where that pain is, whether it's any part of your body, your leg, your knee, your head, whether you stomp your toe or whether you bump your knee against the desk and you experience pain. What I want you to do, for attention, is I want you to take this hand, ball it into a fist, ball this hand into a fist, ball this hand into a fist, tight as you can, tight as you can, tight as you can, hold it up right here, just like that, hold it up, tight as you can, ball into a fist, tight as you can. Now, I want you to concentrate on any pain that's anywhere in your body, wherever that pain might be, put it right here in your mind. You got that pain in your mind. Take a deep breath in, blow it out. Another deep breath in, blow it out. Now, put all that pain right here in your fist. Ball as tight as you can. Tighter, tighter, tighter. Now, the minute you take this breath in and release and release this hand and open your fist, that pain is going to release out of your hand and it's going to be gone from your body permanently ever. You won't feel any pain. Take a deep breath in, exhale and release that fist. Just like you're releasing that pain. And you feel so damn good. Headaches will be disappearing just like that. If you bump your toe, bump your knee, whatever the case might be, you immediately release that pain in your body. Relax. You're doing good. All the way down. Sleep. All the way down. All the way down. And one more time. Here's the trigger. Ball this fist up. Tight as you can. Concentrate on wherever any pain is in your body. Put it in your mind. Take a deep breath in. Now put it in your fist. And as you exhale, release that fist. And release the pain. Release. All the way out. All the way down. And sleep all the way down. That's how simple it is. You want you got a knee injury and you want to play that game. Instead of them giving you Novocaine and giving you neurotransmitters to block it, all you do is you can concentrate and you give your own self that pain pill. Whether you have a headache coming on, whether you fucking walk into that door and hit your head, whatever the case might be, that's how simple it is to release it. You convinced that? <laughs> if I want her to stop smoking, if she smokes cigarettes, whatever, I can go and delete that file out of her mind right now. Right now she's in a perfect state. She's in a state between a uh, delta and a theta. She's right at the borderline. You got four states of, of consciousness. You got the alpha state, which is the most alert state. You got the beta state, which is the sleep state. And then you have the delta, which is a deep state. And the theta is where I can take her down even deeper that she wants to have a baby or want to have an operation without, um, without uh, taking any medication. Watch this. Now then, what I want you to do is I want you to concentrate on for one for me. I want you to concentrate very deeply and listen to everything I tell you to. What I want you to do right now is I want you to remember when you went to the doctor or to the dentist and got a shot of Novocaine in your face. And you took that shot right in your jaw, how it made everything go numb. I want you to put that in your hand right here. Feel right here where I'm touching. I want you to allow this hand to go completely numb, meaning that we no feeling in this hand whatsoever. It's going to go completely numb just like it had five shots of Novocaine. On the count of three, when I snap my fingers, this, fingers, this hand is going to go completely numb. You have no feeling in it whatsoever. One, two, three. Hand completely numb. No matter how hard I pinch it or what I do to it, you won't have any pain in this fucking arm. And I'm pinching it hard as a motherfucker. She don't feel shit. And a lot of pain will come back in this hand. And I want you to take this pain to the side of your jaw. That means that you're not going to have any feeling in this space whatsoever. It's going to be completely numb. It's going to be completely numb. To stand up straight. And with each snap of my finger, you're going to get drunker and drunker and drunker. It's going to be so drunk, you're going to feel all the signs of being drunk. You're going to feel nauseated. You're going to feel like you almost got to throw up. You're not going to throw up. You're going to feel dizzy. You're going to be wobbling. And I tell you to walk a straight line, you're not going to be able to walk a straight line to save your life. You're going to be stumbling, you're going to be wobbling all over the place. 
After two drinks of this Bacardi 151, a lot of suggestions sink in, this absolute truth and total reality. We're going to be toasting to a very, very pleasant night and a very, very good meeting. On the count of three, one, two, three, wide awake. Wakey, wakey. Girl, everybody's having a good damn time. Look at, look at me, look at me, look at me. You, everybody's drinking this, so you got to drink too. Here you go. That's yours. Yeah, that's yours. This is some good damn Bacardi. That's what, don't, don't drink first, just toast. <laughs> that's toast. Good damn, my mind, that's Bacardi. This shit is so... You feel it burning? Yeah, that shit is... No. Oh, that shit is terrible. And take another drink. And set it down. Oh my God, that Bacardi is so damn... Oh my God, it's burning. It's burning going down. <coughs> oh my God. And if you snap my finger, you're going to get more and more drunker. You're going to feel the effects. It's going to begin to get this Bacardi. That shit is... Y'all know how you That's Bacardi too. <laughs> Take another bite. Take some of yours. <laughs> Take a look. You see, that Bacardi is... Yeah. You feel the burn? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. You feel it? <laughs> You're not going to be able to function like a normal person. You want to know why you're so damn wobbly. And one, two, three. Why wait? How much have you been drinking tonight? Stand up a second. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. All day. All day? Okay. Do me a favor. I want you to put your hands out like, a, like you're going like this. Now, why don't you to put your finger and how do you try to find your nose? You're not going to be able to find it. My nose? Yeah, try to find your nose. You're not going to be able to find it with your finger. Because for some reason, try to touch your nose with this hand. Best you can. You're not going to be able to find it. Yeah, I'm trying to put the other one. Try it. It's getting harder and harder. Try it again. Okay, put your hand back. I like to put your hand back. And then try to touch it now. You're not going to be able to find it. For some reason, it's going to be harder and harder to find it. <laughs> and try it again. <laughs> and try the other one. Oh my God. <laughs> no matter how hard you try to find it, you won't be able to find it now. You won't be able to find it. <laughs> Try this time. You will not be able to find it at all. Try it hard as you can. You will not be able to find it. Your nose, if it's not there, try as hard as you can. You'll not be able to find your nose. Try it. Again? Just try it. You can't find it. No matter <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Try another hand. You're not going to be fine at all. Yeah. Okay. You can't find it. It don't exist. <laughs> What I want you to do right here, stop right here, stop right here. What I want you to do, I want you to put your foot on this line, walk this line, put your foot on this line. I want you to put heel to toe, heel to toe. You're not going to be able to, as you walk, you're going to be wobbling, and you're not going to be able to come to me. You want to, you are drunker than a sofa. Oh!
Damn. Right here. Right, let's see. And look at me. That one works. And look at me. And this one works. And look at me. And sleep all the way down. Relax and perfect. All the way down. Dreaming, drifting, floating. Deeper, deeper, deeper. More relaxed. Sleep. All the way down. Very good. <coughs> Thank you very much. Yeah. And all the way down. Now then. Now that they do the shenanigans and this show is over, we're going to wake you up one last time. On the count of five, you're going to be wide awake. You're going to wake up feeling better than you ever felt in your entire life. All the suggestions I gave you have been removed. You're going to be as normal as you were when you walked in the door. You're going to be as sober as you were when you walked in the door. You're going to be able to remember everything that you <coughs> remember when you walked in the door. But your eyesight is going to be better. Your memory is going to be improved. You can remember anything that you want to remember. As a matter of fact, we're going to turn it up a little bit more. In your mind, there's a keyboard. That keyboard looks just like a mixing console. On that keyboard, it has all kind of knobs. Each knob controls something. It controls your memory, it controls your anger, your pain, your emotion. It controls everything. What I want you to do is I want you to look on that keyboard, and at your own leisure, I want you to reach up with your right hand and find the knob that says memory. Reach up with your right hand. Find a knob that says memory. Grab that knob. Reach up high. Reach up higher. Reach up high. Grab that knob. Now, as you grab that knob, your memory right now is at a 4. I want you to turn it up to like a 10. Turn it up. Just like you turn the volume up on your video. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now, push your index finger and lock it in. Very good. Now, put your hand down. Very good. What you just did now is we just turned up our memory from a 4 to a 10. That means you can remember anything you want from the day that you were born. You can remember everything you read, everything you heard, everything you experienced, everything you saw, anything in the song, the lyrics. You can remember names, you can remember birthdays, you can remember formulas. Whatever it is that you ever heard or saw is now easy to recall and bring it back into your mind. I want you to departmentalize everything that you want to, whether it was English, math, sciences, whether it was experiences, whether it was songs, whether it was names, dates. You can remember faces with names. In the past, you might have had a problem remembering names. You can remember faces but remember names. You had problems remembering numbers. Everything is going to be easily and readily accessible and bring it back immediately without hesitation. A lot of suggestions sink in. And in the morning when you wake up, you're going to wonder, why are you having all these creative thoughts? Why are all these things coming to you? Why are you remembering things that you thought you had forgotten a long, long time ago? Everything will be easily to remember and easily available to you whenever you want to think about it. All you got to do is take this hand, put one finger up, and put this finger to your temple and think about it. And it's going to come back to you immediately without hesitation. A lot of suggestions sink in is absolute truth and total reality. Your memory right now is almost a perfect photographic memory. Everything will be easily and accessible to you instantly without hesitation. Names, dates, schedules, times, whatever it might be. A lot of suggestions sink in. It's absolute truth and total reality. A lot of that to sink deep, deep, deep into your subconscious. And when you've accepted that suggestion, nod your head one time for me, yes. Nod your head one time, yes, when that suggestion has sunk deep, deep, deep into your subconscious. You got it? Now nod, nah, one time, yes. Very good. You've accepted that on your own accord. Your memory has now come full force. You're going to be able to remember everything. On the count of three, on the count of five, you're going to be wide awake. Feeling better than you ever felt in your entire life. You're going to feel like you had a ten hour nap and a five hour massage. You can party, you can go all damn night if you want to. You're going to feel like you had ten Red Bulls or five five hour energy drinks. You're going to feel so damn good. Your head is going to be clear. You're not going to have any listlessness, no grogginess, no ill effects. You're going to feel like, damn, I feel so good, like you're walking on air. One, take a deep breath in. Blowing out. Two, feel all that energy begin to flow back into that body. Three, accepting that all suggestions I gave to you, you're going to be able to see better, you're going to be able to hear better, feel better, think better. You're going to be able to remember everything you want to remember. Three, take another deep breath in. Feel that body becoming more energized. No listeners, no grogginess, no headaches. You're going to wake up laughing and knowing you had the best time of your life. 
You're going to remember everything that happened here today. It's going to come back to you in about five minutes. The first five minutes, you're not going to remember anything. But after about five minutes, all of this stuff is going to come rolling back to you, and you're going to laugh your ass off. You're going to say, I can't be believe he did that to me. But you're going to realize you had a good time, and you were our entertainment for the night. And four, eyes begin to flutter, energy coming back into that body. And when I clap my hands on five, you're going to be wide awake, wondering what the hell is going on. And five, wide awake, wakey, wakey. How you feel? Good. You feel good? Give me a stretch. <laughs> Give me a stretch, big stretch. Okay. I know everything's gonna come back. It's gonna feel so good in a minute. And when I snap my fingers, all the energy in that body, you're gonna feel like you just woke up from a 10 hour nap and a five hour massage. It's just like that. Rotate your shoulders. Stretch. Stand up. Alright, let me see you touch your nose. You can find your nose now. Let me see you touch your nose. Oh, there you go. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> you should do that. <laughs> I couldn't find my nose. <laughs> Seriously. I, I was like trying so hard, like, it's right here. It's right here. <laughs> you are wonderful, girl. You are the best. You gotta look back at this shit. <laughs> What do you think, Flo? Oh. What do you think? That was crazy. crazy. I got a cup of tea. Seriously. It was so good. I need your card. <laughs> <laughs> she need my card. No, you need a... Yeah. Find your nose.